when I reference a random movie from 1998 that you swear down, you was the only person that saw it, you swear down, Every time you mention it among your friend groups or family members, nobody else remembers that same film. But the second you come across my TikTok video and I reference it, and it's like, yo, he just unlocked a memory. He just unlocked something that I thought I only remembered. That's what my content is meant to do. Now, my content did not begin and end with just pop culture references from my childhood. Born in 1995, so it's, it's not just that. Still at the base of it all is building community by showing something that makes somebody feel seen and understood. The base of it all is connecting people through media, building community, showing people that actually care about what they think, showing people that I can create things based off of their ideas. Because nowadays with social media, we have just about unlimited access to way more people than we would have without social media, right? With the advent of the DM, you can connect with people in ways that just in human history was just previously unimaginable. So when somebody deems me an idea about a piece of content that they would like to see me bring to life, that is an opportunity for me to help somebody feel seen and understood. When that idea is dope, I, it aligns with what I want to put out in the world. It you know, connects with my brand, then the dopest thing that I could do is take an idea from somebody who supports what I put out and then bring it to life in the way that they imagined it and in the way that I imagined it and then watch that idea go viral. That is so dope. I remember being on Vine and just watching people make stuff and just being like, man, that'd have been so dope if they could have did this, or if they could have made this type of video, if they could have referenced that. And on Vine, we didn't have DMs or anything like that. So I didn't have the same level of connectivity, you know, that we have in 2023. But being able to like just DM somebody and just say, yo, your videos are actually really funny. I really enjoy what you're doing. Thanks for existing. I received messages like that. It was really dope. And then being able to connect with other content creators and just to know that my brain ain't the only one that works the way it does. Because now I'm not just in the business of making viewers and supporters feel seen, heard, and understood. With MDM Network, I'm trying to develop a, a situation where I help other content creators feel seen, heard, and understood. You can't lose. You can't lose when you're trying to build community for something good, positive, productive. So MDM Network, we're in the early stages. We're in the early stages. And it's developing beautifully. So, stick around, St stick around, because if you see this video, you are part of the early stages. So I thank you. I'm trying to become a content creator full time. I, I want to not just survive for my content, I want to thrive from creating content. We, we gonna see, but we ain't gonna see nothing if I don't post. So take that for your situation. If you if you trying to do anything, I ain't got nothing with content creation. Whatever your dream is, whatever your desire is to do a thing, you won't be able to make it to the next level, whatever that thing is. Ain't nothing gonna happen unless you take that next step forward. I don't know what that next step looks like for you, but please, please make the step. Because a year from whenever you're consuming this piece of content, you will look back and say, I'm glad I took that step. I am glad I took that step. Or if you don't take that step, to look back a year from whenever you're consuming this content and say, Man, I wonder what would have happened if.